Hello, everyone. I am sorry I can't be with you today, but I am hoping uh, to still have a little fun with you virtually. Isn't that interesting? So I have an activity for today that's going to require you to test some of your skills that we've talked about before. Uh, we've been working on our soul edge throughout the year, here and there. You've heard things like uh, the snowman rule. We've talked about Lola. We've talked about lines and spaces. And uh, I kind of have a just a fun activity that could help us um, maybe practice learning that a little bit more. Uh, today's won't be too difficult, uh, but it is, it's still going to make you think. So I hope you guys uh, dig in and have a little fun with me. Although I feel like there's something on my, there's something on my, do you see that thing? What, what is that there? Do you see that? Is there a speck on the screen? What is that? Let's see what this is. Oh, I see. Oh, it's our activity that we're going to be doing today. So we're going to be coloring by Solfege. The only notes that we're going to need, let's see, uh, should we do lightsaber? Let's do like Luke Skywalker. Uh, we're only going to be doing so and me. We only need to know two of our Solfege syllables for this, but it should be pretty good. Um, let's take a look at the first activity, shall we? All right, hopefully you can see here that we have this beautiful spring uh, coloring page that we're going to take a look at. Uh, and I've got all of these weird things, uh, MSS, MSM, MMS, all sorts of that stuff over here. Uh, eventually we're going to color all of this and it'll look nice and beautiful, but you need to figure out how to color it. You've, I know you've done color by number, but maybe you've never done color by solfege. Here's your key. We're going to be using pink, blue, yellow, orange, green, and purple. Uh, but we need to know um, how to tell what color is what. So let's figure that out here. First things first. Uh, when your substitute teacher hands you this sheet, I need to know who you are. So make sure you write your name on your piece of paper. I also wouldn't mind knowing what class you're in, too. So... Um, let's see, whose class am I in today? <laughs> okay, excellent. And now that we are ready to go, uh, let's figure this out. It says, fill in the lines below each note, let's see, with an S for so or an M for me. That's pretty easy. Use the patterns to figure out what the colors are. Okay. Well, come see me for a second, and I'll explain this. All right. Oh, hello. Welcome. Uh, we need to know a couple things, right? Number one, we need to know what to use, whether we're going to use so or me. So let's do this. I'm going to just, on my sheet of paper, draw out our solfege syllables so that we have do, re, mi, fa, so, La, ti, do. Excellent. Now, what did we say we were working on? We're only working with two. We only have two choices, either so or me. Hmm, let's think about this for a second. Now, on a lot of the sheets that I have been giving you this year, I've been really nice, and I've been marking which line or space is do. You know, because sometimes I'll say, ooh, this line is... Uh, dough or ooh, this space is dough. This sheet does not do that for you. And do we need it to? So far, we've already figured out that there's only two notes, either so or me. Now, I'm going to ask you a question, and I'm going to change lightsabers. I'm going to go to the dark side. Um, which one's higher, so or me? I'm looking out in the room, looking out in the room. Okay, I see lots of hands out there. Give me a number one if you think it's so. Two, if you think it's me, which one's higher? One or two? One or two? If you're saying one, I agree with you. You're exactly right. So is higher than me. So if I see these three notes here, two of them are the same. One of them's different. This one is lower. These two are higher. So hopefully, hopefully, hope I'm hoping that you are with me in thinking that this is me because it's lower. And the next two are so because they are higher. And that means, let's see, that, ooh, that anytime you see MSS, you're going to color it green. So let's take a look. 
<laughs> oh no, I'm disappearing. So I'm looking for an MSS. Oh my goodness, there is a lot of green on here. Do you see this? MSS here, MSS, MSS. You know, oh, that one there too. Now, I'm just going to just take one second and we're just going to do a little coloring here. Uh, what color did we say? Green? All right, so I would just very quickly, ah, hopefully you guys are going to do better than me. But all of that square is supposed to be green, okay? Now, I want to make sure you have plenty of time. So we're just going to do one more, okay? So let's see, uh, let's look at the purple. This should not be too bad, right? Let me, in fact, let me turn my purple pen on. Um, it looks like high, low, high. One of them, two of them are the same, one's different. Which one of these is going to be so, and which one's going to be me? Hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, you remembered. Yes, 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 yes. That so is higher and me is lower. So is higher. So you would look around on your sheet and try to figure out which one of those says S, M, S, S, M, S. Oh, it's the one next to the green. Nice. So hopefully nicer than me. You would color all of that square in a beautiful purple. Take more time than me, okay? So I'm thinking that you are ready to go. If you have questions, you can ask your sub. He or she is highly qualified and probably knows just about just as much about music as I do. So make sure you ask those questions. Uh, high, low, and high. So, me, and so, okay? Uh, those sheets are going to come around. Make sure you put your name on it. Make sure you put your class teacher on it, or you can even do your class code, like S3, that sort of thing. Uh, and then think to yourself, so is higher, me is lower. That's going to help you figure out what all the colors are, okay? Uh, I hope you guys are well. Hoping to see you guys very soon, okay? Take care.